Okay, so the first area of my room I'm going to be focusing on is the more boring area. Um, this is the other side where my de the other side of the room, the side where my desk isn't. So here I've got um, a board with tickets and photos, all that sort of stuff on that board there. Um, here I actually have a stairs leading up to my bed at the top. Stairs go all the way down, as you can see. Here I've got a poster, I'm quite a big rugby fan, as you know, well many of you will know. Um, I support the Worcester Warriors, so that's the poster. Um, that's a poster of Johnny Wilkinson, who is a fantastic rugby player. Um, I also have a CD rack here. Um, I don't really listen to CDs much more, as you know, because I tend to download nowadays. I think CDs are kind of going out of fashion and they get, they're getting unneeded really so I don't really I don't personally tend to listen to them anymore I tend to download digital music um, down here I've got like a little sort of um, it's just got cushions on so I can use it as like a sort of sofa thing but I never I always tend to dump in clothes in it so it never really gets used to sitting on um, I've got some revision books down here Got an English exam in about a month, so I'm doing well. Doing revision, revision for that. Um, here's my chair. It's an IKEA chair. Um, yeah, it's quite creaky every time I sit in there. It's very, it creaks a lot. Um, it's still not a bad chair. It's just makes a lot of noise. Um, down here is um, another little stool which is useful if I've got a friend around. Here's my guitar, Ibanez Reg series, um, a mini uh, Marshall amp down there. So here's my uh, main desk area. Up here I've got a couple of shelves. Here I've got a clapper board used in films. Got lights there. A BBC bag. I've got my MacBook Pro here. This is the mid-09 version. I got it about literally almost a year ago now. Um, it's still running well. I need to upgrade the RAM though. It's only on 2 gigs of RAM. It's something I said I was going to do from the start, but still haven't, still haven't got around to doing it. But I will do a few upgrades on that soon um, when I get around to it. But it still runs fine for what I use it for. You know, I use Final Cut and stuff on there, and it does. It does run pretty okay for you know for the amount of stuff I do on there. So down here is my keyboard. It's the Apple one from a couple of years ago with the numeric pad. It's also got Final Cut stickers on there to help my editing. These are the iFrox ear pollution headphones down there. I have the um, Neil Poulton designed one terabyte hard drive. It's not portable. It's one. It's plugged in. Um, Magic Mouse there, Apple Magic Mouse. I've got my iPhone 4 here. On the, crap, sorry about that. On the iPhone 4 dock. Pretty expensive dock for what it is, really. But I got it, well, it's worth, you can get it for £25 off the Apple website, off Apple basically, and I got it for £15 off eBay. The one problem I had there didn't come in a proper box. It's, it is a genuine Apple one though, but it didn't come in a proper box. Nothing that matters that much. Um, here's the ZZ case carbon pouch. You may have seen my review on my old channel, Apple Tech 001. I may um, upload that to the gadget zone for you guys, so yeah, look out for that. Um, down here behind my, bo behind my guitar, I've got a few boxes, Apple boxes down there. Um, I'll just show you them, take my guitar out of the way iPhone 4, iPhone 3G, uh, Apple keyboard, you know, all that good stuff. Put that back. Um, I've got a printer up there with a com my Converse box there. Um, here I've got my G a GB flag on my wardrobe. With, this is the case I use for my camera, which I'm using at the moment, it's the Panasonic SD20. Um, this is a few bags on my door. Apple, Jack Wills, um, yeah, and wetsuit as well. 
Um, that's the Guitar Hero drum set as well as a hard case for my guitar. Um, so that's about it. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time on the Gadget Zone. Thank you.